Easily add text to images using the Add Text function from the toolbar, or tap the T shortcut key. Click Add New Text to access the Text Settings panel. This automatically creates a text box on a new layer. Input text by typing directly into the text box within the canvas or from the Text Settings panel. The Transform option controls the appearance of the text box, such as size and its positioning within the canvas. This can also be done manually by clicking and dragging the handles. Both left and right handles adjust width and the bottom one for overall size. The circular handle at the top will allow for rotations. The directional cursor appears when the mouse pointer is moved over the text box. Click and drag to move it around the canvas. Access the font library to choose from a great selection of fonts. Mouse over any font to see a direct preview. Click to select and apply. For custom fonts, they can be uploaded here. Use the Fill function to customize text appearance. Change text color using the Color option. Cycle through different hues using the slider, then choose a preferred tone. Gradient applies a transitional blend between two or more colors. Choose from presets or create new gradients with the Gradient Editor. It can also be used to modify existing presets. The Gradient bar shows how the transition looks. Under it are color stops that represent the colors available in the gradient. The appearance of the gradient can be altered by moving these stops. Hovering the mouse pointer under the gradient bar changes it to a plus symbol. Click to add more stops along the bar where a color can then be assigned to it. Remove any unwanted stops by selecting it and clicking the trash can icon. Linear creates a transitional gradient in a straight line. The positioning of the angle can be adjusted with the direction slider. Radial creates an elliptical gradient that radiates outwards from the center. Pattern applies stylized patterns to text. Pattern size and direction can be further customized using their respective sliders. Transparency controls the opacity of the text. Slide left to make it more transparent and right to make it more opaque. Size controls the size of the text. For readability and legibility, line spacing controls the spacing between lines of text. Letter spacing controls the space between each letter. Use a line to set the positioning for text. Align left, center, or right. Style determines the text attributes in a specific style. Change from lowercase to uppercase, italic, or bold. The Curve function creates circular or curved text. There are three styles available, each having options for further customization. Arc, Circle, or Half Circle. Background adds a solid color fill behind text and can be used to make text stand out. 
Choose different colors and tones by using the color picker. Punch out when enabled removes text fill color from the background to let the underlying layer show through. Offset shifts the text away from the center of the background along a vertical axis. Text backgrounds are available in three styles. Full, which covers the entirety of the text box, by line, or by word. Outline creates an outer border around each letter, in which colors can also be customized. Enable the Punch Out function to remove the text fill color so only the outline remains. Control the size of the outline by dragging the slider left or right. Distance offsets the position of the outline away from the middle. Adjust direction to determine the angle for where the outline will be placed. This feature will only be effective if the distance function is applied. Shadow creates a drop shadow effect that gives depth to the text. Blur determines the softness of the shadow. Slide right for a feathery blurred effect, and left to make it solid. Distance moves the position of the shadow further away from or nearer to the text. Direction determines the angle of where the shadow is placed. Opacity controls the transparency of the shadow effect. Higher opacity creates a darker shadow, and a lower opacity creates a transparent shadow. Pixlr also has a variety of textile templates that can be used instantly. Elements in textiles will appear on their own layers and are customizable using all available text options that were just explored. Click on an object directly or select from the Layers panel to start customizing. Change fonts, color or style in just a few clicks.